This psalm calls upon the people of God to praise Him with joy and music. The psalmist gives us a multitude of reasons to praise God. He is true. He is faithful. He is righteous. He is just. He created the universe by His powerful word. His purposes stand forever. He is not a disinterested God who is somewhere far out there, but rather one who loves us, watches over us, and one who cares for us dearly. As we face threats and dangers in life, we are reminded that we cannot save ourselves. We need to humbly turn to God for His deliverance. The ultimate deliverance, of course, is from sin and death. And hell through the death and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ. How reassuring it is to know that we can rely on this wonderful God who is in control of all things. He alone is our eternal hope in these uncertain and difficult times. We have reason to rejoice. What an awesome God we have, and what privilege we have to magnify His name and trust in Him. Let's read Psalm 33. Sing joyfully to the Lord, you righteous. It is fitting for the upright to praise Him. Praise the Lord with the harp. Make music to Him on the ten string lyre. Sing to Him a new song. Play skillfully and shout for joy. For the word of the Lord is right and true. He is faithful in all He does. The Lord loves righteousness and justice. The earth is full of His unfailing love. By the word of the Lord, the heavens were made; their starry hosts by the breath of His mouth. He gathers the water of the sea into jars; He puts the deep into storehouses. Let all the earth fear the Lord; let all the people of the world revere Him. For He spoke, and it came to be; He commanded, and it stood firm. The Lord forms the plans of the nations. He thwarts the purposes of the peoples, but the plans of the Lord stand firm forever. The purposes of His heart through all generations. Blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord, the people He chose for His inheritance. From heaven the Lord looks down and sees all mankind. From His dwelling place He watches all who live on earth. He who forms the hearts of all, who considers everything they do, no king is safe by the size of his army, no warrior escapes by his great strength. A horse is a vain hope for deliverance; despite all its great strength, it cannot save. But the eyes of the Lord are on those who fear Him, on those whose hope is in His unfailing love, to deliver them from death. And keep them alive in famine. We wait in hope for the Lord. He is our help and our shield. In Him our hearts rejoice, for we trust in His holy name. May Your unfailing love be with us, Lord, even as we put our hope in You. Let's pray, gracious God and heavenly Father. We come before your presence, giving you all praise and glory for the sovereign and excellent God that you are. As we journey with you in this life, few dangers, toils, and snares, we pray you will help us to hope in your unfailing love. Thank you, God, for salvation we have in Christ. We entrust ourselves to you that your grace may sustain us and deliver us in our time of need. Amen.